got your new Galaxy phone and wants to transfer all your data from your old Android or iOS device to this new device, this video is perfect for you. For those who are watching my video for the first time, this is Amit here and you can subscribe to my channel by clicking the bell button below. So let's get started. In this video, I am using my Samsung Galaxy S8 with iPhone 7 Plus. The steps will remain same for all your old devices. Either it can be Android, iPhone, Windows or Blackberry. To start the transfer of the data, you have to open this smart switch app on your Galaxy device. Once you open it, you will get an option for USB cable and Wi-Fi. For now, we will select Wi-Fi and see what are the options. Then you have to select which is this device, either you want to send or receive it. We are going to want to receive on this device. So I'll click on receive on device. Then we are getting four devices. What is your old device? iOS, Android. We'll select iOS for now. Once you select, you will have to log in into your iCloud. Before logging into iCloud, you have to disable your second factor of authentication on your iCloud so that you are able to select what is the backup available there and you can restore on this device. We are not going to use the Wi-Fi approach and for this we are going to use the USB. You will require an OTG adapter for transferring your data using the USB cable. This is the OTG adapter which I got with my Galaxy device. If you lost your OTG adapter for some reason, you can easily get this from eBay to from three to five dollars. So we will require lightning cable to connect our iPhone and the Galaxy device. Once you connect your iPhone with the Galaxy device, it will ask you to trust your device. For me, it's not asking the reason because I'm connecting this device for the second time. And once your device is connected, it will try to search the data on your iPhone. This process will take nearly 15 minutes. It is always recommended whenever you are getting your device, you can do this transfer at that time only because now there are different different process running on your phone. So it might take longer time and it also depend upon how much data you are having your iPhone. If you are purchasing this device from retailer, they will try to sell you some products which can be useful for transferring the data and on online also you can get many products which help you to transfer data but this is one of the best tool which I saw till now Samsung smart switch which transfer all your data and so easily so instead of going for a free or paid app or some tool from retailer this is the best app which I can suggest you and it is too good. The searching of the data will take some time. Once it reach 70%, this will be done too fast. As you can see, the searching of data have reached to 95%. This will take another 10 to 12 seconds to complete 100%. This is the how we can transfer for Android as well as iPhone and blackberry even the windows device so this process will remain same if you want to transfer data once this process reach 100 percent we will get the list of the data which we can move from this device to your new galaxy device so as you can see we can transfer all our data like contact messages call log calendar alarm clock even notes we can select our wallpaper and transfer it video audio music document everything we can transfer from your old device to new device by selecting a message we are getting different option also like 30 days three months one year so all your message whatever message you want to transfer you can select it for this purpose i am just selecting my calendar since i already sync all my data or transfer all my data from my iPhone to my Galaxy device. So I will show you how you can transfer it. So for this video, I'm just selecting my calendar. This process, if you are, depends upon how much data you are having for transfer, but if you're doing for the first time, it will take less time. So as you can see, my calendar has been transferred. 
and this process got completed so this way you can transfer all your data from your iPhone to your Galaxy E device that's all for this video if you like my video please subscribe to my channel and put a thumbs up for my video thanks for watching it